All right, what is up, you beautiful people, and welcome back to a, another round <clears throat> of uh, Stronghold. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Not Stronghold Synergy. Stronghold Synergy. Stronghold Synergy. We're playing some Hot and Horner today. Um, Hot and Horner has been gutted, yes, but uh, we are going to run the Hot and Horner Pipe Dream. And that Pipe Dream is going Mass Assault Galleons. That is the Pipe Dream, baby. Um, that requires me to go to tier 3, and my team to not be dead. We got Raynor, but he built a Vulture, so we're dead. Um, <laughs> usually a good sign that Raynor is going to be a meme is when he goes Vultures. I don't know. I don't know about you guys, but I think Vultures are actually, like, completely useless. Um, like, as a unit. I don't know, like, like you can use them to stall and stuff. Like, kinda. Like, they're okay. We're, oh god, there's a Nova here. Eh, carriers don't care about Nova. Anyways. We got stronghold here, so base is being built up as we push up. Um, <clears throat> we have synergy, so we all strong at the same time. My magmines are just gonna go boom. I notice they like actually have a little bit of a spin on them. That looks pretty cool. Uh, so assault galleons cost 675, so I'm gonna have depression. And there's a Kerrigan, which means she can build mutalisk, and I'm also gonna have depression. Um, so basically, Han and Horner, um, the only unit you can build is uh, nothing. And um, you uh, can't play this game. <laughs> At least they should have given back Han and Horner like their original prices. I think like the Hellions and Hellbats got like almost close to their original prices, but like no Sovereign BC and it just being a simple call down is just kind of a waste. Okay, we got some vultures on. Okay, so it's got enemy rain. Ah, yikes, that's pretty tough. Um, well, Tychus can't really send any guys out until like now. I guess he's not sending any guys out. He's not gonna, he's not even gonna send out Tychus himself. Okay, shotgun is gonna devastate us here. Um, yep, yeah, rip vultures. Shotgun has such a wide blast radius. You know, how is Nova allowed to have shotgun? But Han and Horner is not allowed to have cheaper prices. You know what I'm saying, guys? Sometimes it's, sometimes it just ain't fair, you know? Or at least like a uh, unnerfed Deimos Viking uh, assault mode, because honestly, assault mode was really the only thing Han and Horner had for Deimos Vikings that would keep it like, like that, that would keep them viable. Because without assault mode, they're just lower range Vikings that, yes, they're pretty strong in the mid game, but late game, and eh, they, they don't really scale. Like it's just a, it's just a cluster. It's a cluster truck, you know. They don't really have AOE either, you know. Um, so, like, their AoE is pretty false. Uh, anyway, I'm only going to have Reapers come out of here because uh, Galleons, I just I just wanted to generate Reapers. 12 seconds. Oh, my God. Give me my 10-second Reaper training time. Please, Cerrone. Anyways, I could probably have one make um, Hellions, to be fair. Um, but, yeah. Let's turn all these off. But, yeah. I'm just probably going to send out some Galleons. Like, I think that's the only thing I can do. Generate value. But like 12 seconds for a Reaper? I don't know. Well, to be fair, the Polaritron Torpedo has such a long range. It um, keeps it relatively safe and allows it to generate quite a bit of value. So you can see here, Kerrigan's not really able. So it's like it's like really the best Siege unit. And it's the best unit Han and Horror can realistically build uh, for this week. Because um, everything else you have just uh, really doesn't hold up. Uh, and uh-oh... There it is, the Goliaths. The Goliaths uh, disabling us here, and uh, we are just going to get shut down. So in order to combat that, we have to go tier 3, and uh, we have to get the Drone Hanger, because the Drone Hanger just doesn't care. Um, okay. And I hate that it's actually disabling the manufacturer. The stun is, like, insane. But yeah, at least Nova's not getting tanks, so hopefully we can transition into, like, a heavy ground combo with my allies. Um, backing me up on the ground here in the form of Rainer tanks and Tychus Boswells, but if that doesn't happen, then, um, well, let's just say that's not a great situation. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna try and, okay, so I'm tier 3 now, I'm gonna try and get another Galleon, to be fair. I can probably just get a call in the fleet here, or at least cooldown and call in the fleet should be lower. I don't know. Before it used to be like a like before when it was a permanent battle cruiser that you would get, then I understood that prices could be higher. But now it's just a one-time use battle cruiser, so I'm just like, it's really not that great. 
Um, one of the enemies has been flagged as AFK. Okay, well, they were probably saving their Hyperion. So, congratulations. Um, I'm going to have one of these make Hellions. And I'm going to allow them to train Hellions. And then I'm just going to put drone hangers on them. Uh, but one of the enemies is AFK, which means we're going to see twice as many Goliaths. Which means we'll probably want some grenade cars. But to be fair, Goliaths are decently bad against Tychus. Oh, Marine. Get him, Marine. Get him, Marine. We got sick damage here. He's slowly whittling away. Got my Reaper here. Doing his little, his little Pipiga Blast. We got Banshees coming in here. Very, very interesting. Drone Hangers. I mean, to be fair, if, uh, what is it? Tar Bombs? Oh my god, I need to make sure the tar bombs are on, are on auto cast. Because I actually would like um, to get some more tar bombs. Um, these Spider Mans are going to be kind of useless here. Uh, okay, drone hanger. Drones are out. Rockets red glare. Rockets red glare, baby. I'm going to get the tar bombs out here if possible. I would like those research. And I would like the aerosol stem research so that we can, um, you know get cooking. The little interceptors are just going to keep firing regardless of if the goliaths um, stun them or not. So at least we got that going. Um, I hope Rainer spartans up and gets some tanks uh, instead of going banshees because um, banshees are quite frankly useless. They're being countered by the goliaths as we speak. Um, but I hope Tychus does something interesting instead of... well he's got a Kev. That's pretty interesting actually. Well I can call in the fleet here. Let's go. Uh, and then go overcharge reactor, overcharge reactor, and now it's gone forever, boys. Nice me. Well, at least it's here. At least it has arrived. But it's like a baby power spike every, like, five bajillion years. So its actual impact is not even as good as, like, a Karax laser beam. But, like, a Karax laser beam at least is pretty, is pretty insane. Um, yeah, I mean, but all these Goliaths here... Hmm. He's attacking a shield battery, bro? Yikes. That's a big yikes. I mean, to be fair, these are only Goliaths. They're only Goliaths. They're pretty good against most things, though. But not against Kev. So, if uh, I'm going to be making them panic and buy mass Goliaths, and my allies can benefit from that, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, Rainer, we need tanks. Rainer, we need tanks. Tanks to counter this and to counter that. Um, but I don't know. Maybe Rainer doesn't want to build tanks. Have one. Lamau. Has one tank. Well, you know what? That's a start. That's a start. Better than nothing. I'm pretty sure I do like 10% damage right now. Yeah. I don't know, man. The alternative is like I build some very unfulfilling units that do next to nothing. Um, I don't know, like grenade cars just blow up and then like that's it. Like that's all they that's all they got, you know? Um, but yeah. Tell me Rainer at least has fast siege. Got the four armor here. Okay, this guy left. Not enough minerals. Okay. <sighs> Yikes. I think we can still win this. As long as Rainer keeps going tanks. Should be okay. Um, did my hybrid double up? My hybrid didn't double up. My hybrid were not the ones that doubled up. Okay, so let's turn all these off. And let's turn all these off. I need these things to generate value here. Uh, I hope Rainer just keeps spamming tanks, because that's what we need right now. My fleet of galleons is going to be here, and uh, it is going to start overwhelming these Goliaths quite easily. He has 2-2. doesn't matter that he has 2-2, though, because the galleon overrun. We got double Torast. I think as long as the galleons are focus firing... Uh, well, no, they're not focus firing the Goliaths. Feels bad, man. Don't worry, I got my next wave coming up here. Next wave. Um, oh wait, this is the Rainer wave. To be fair, Banshees are actually pretty good against Goliaths. 
Um, they are still pretty good against Goliaths. Um, especially when they're doubled up. So now, we're, now it's a 2v2, so we, we actually have a fighting chance. Thank you for leaving Tychus um, and doing... Well, doing something, I guess. I don't know. I'm 33% I'm of the team. Rainer's like still carrying me. Oh, I should have uh, timed my hybrid to come down on the wave that I'm doubled up. I should time my Sovereign BC to come down on the wave that I'm doubled up. So, I sh yeah, I should really try and do that. Let's see. Got my Reapers coming in here. Uh, you know what? I should probably just like summon regular old grenade cars. Just um, for the anti-armor. No, I think we lose here. Oh, Rainer, please. Why did Rainer open vultures into banshees? These should have been these banshees should have been tanks. Like, yes, I have galleons, but also it's just to prove a point. I don't know. To be fair, I don't know if I went Hellbat Hellion. Maybe that would have done something, but then Nova could have just gone tanks. And then that would have just been devastating. Anyways. Um, R.I.P. Yeah. Han and Horner. Literally impossible. I don't know, boys. What do you guys think? Is Han and Horner gutted? I haven't played Han and Horner in a while for a reason. Um, we're going to play something else after this. Because that was a pretty short game. So I'll see you guys in the second one. Alright, we're back. Surprise. We're playing Arcanus. A real commander. Actually, I don't know how real commander is Artanis is gonna be this week um, Because everything important that you need is a little expensive Like high archons high on the list of things you want price also very high. So yeah I'm just gonna go to tier 2 here Might have to sacrifice some levels of hybrid chamber just to like, you know exist got our double supply depot here back to back got to put down some photon cannons here just to um, prevent um, these pylons from spawning in. Bam, bam. Probes getting absolutely blasted here. Get them, photon cannons. Pew, pew. Nice. We got a oh, Zagara. That's rough. I think against Zagara, I have to Artanis it up. I mean, Artanis it up. I have to Reaver it up. The only problem with Reavers is they also... Actually, Reavers cost less than Galleons. And they're better. I don't know, boys. <laughs> I don't know. They also produce units, so to speak. It's like if Zagara had like a bio ship that summoned the Banelings. You know, that's basically what a Reaver really is. Um, Tychus also calls for Reavers. Ugh, okay. We are going to have to sacrifice some hybrid levels. Um, like, for sure. Void was the Tychus that left last game. He was like, yeah, I'm out. We got the Haka. The Haka can soften something up. Supply Depot here taking a taking a hit for that Marine. But now it's gonna burn down. I should probably send something out, but uh Hmm. Anything I send out right now is probably just gonna get like foddered off. Um so I might as well just save the money right now. Uh Tychus at the moment is winning because we do have uh a Dahaka who is a little bit tankier. I'm probably just going to have to summon Hybrid Reavers just for the minerals, and so I can contribute something to the team. I think I might have to forego the second gas here and just aggressively push, um, because Stahaka is also aggressively pushing tier 2. He's probably going for some Reavers. Not Reavers, but no, Impalers. Um, but to be fair, I don't know who the last guy is, so that's kind of sus. Is Tychus red? He's not red. Okay. Interesting. Oh my god, why am I lagging? Bruh, hello? That is ridiculous. I'm not even rendering anything right now. Somebody's like downloading stuff, probably. Lamel. Anyways, here's a Reaver. Anyways, here's Wonderwall. Um, there we go. Reaver's out. Reaver's out, baby. Sun's out, bun's out. Oh my god, Reaver is way too far up for it, front. Oh my god. No one's building front line on this team, huh? Um... Come on, Reaver. Let's go. Let me put him on the side here. Well, you know what? Daka is the front line, but like he's so far back. Okay, let's do that here. And let's start focusing on getting some more Reavers here. Pew! 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 We're out of ammo. 
Lamau. Feels out of ammo, boys. Reavers even train their units faster, you know? Reavers are just better. Should should Han and Horner just get Reavers instead? Like, just get rid of Hellions, bro. I'm not Hellions. Uh, get, get, get rid of the carrier. Replace it with the Reaver, you know? I would much rather have access to Reavers than the Galleons. I don't know, man. Han and Horner is a meme. And... Yeah. That needs to be fixed. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we got some Econ coming in now. We got our shield overcharge. Uh, last guy is Statman. Oh, baby. My Reavers are not going to have a good time. Marine, hold them at bay. Pew. Okay, my Reaver got out one shot. That's all I care about. I'm going to send out another Reaver here. Two Reavers. I mean, to be fair, all we need is a Blaze, and that'll give us a bad time. But then Tychus is invested in a blaze, whereas our Tychus has had the uh, opportunity to invest in something else. I don't know. I got the Scarab uh, housing so my Reavers can start reloading like ASAP as soon as they get out the base. There is a Vega. Aha. Uh -huh. Interesting. Get 25% increased splash radius. Okay, the Haka can just eat that. Nice meme. Wait, that's not a Stepman. That's just a regular old spine crawler. Oh my god. That's an Abathur, boys. Well, good thing Reavers are good against those, too. You know what? Reaver is like the best pesticide, you know? You got a problem on the ground, just call Reavers. See, the best part about Reavers is Vega can take them, and then my Reavers are like, Lamau, I'm out of ammo, bro. Congratulations. I'm literally useless to you. Good good luck. <laughs> that, I love Reavers, man. They're like unhackable. Unhackable. By the time like our opponents need them, they're out of ammo. Pew! Hit him with the... I need to get an Observer. Oh no, look. Did Tychus leave the game? Tychus left... Oh no, Tychus left the game. Tychus left the game. He built Reaver he built something to take over my Reavers and then immediately regrets it because the Reavers are completely useless. They're un they're they're just they're just sabotage proof, you know? That's why Reavers are so good. Can't sabotage them. And Reavers are really good against our tan I mean, yeah, they're really good against Cigar as well. Because they're just They're just aberration handguns. You know? They're like, what if we loaded Banelings into a Glock? and started blasting. That's the Reaver experience, baby. Pew! 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 But to be fair, I wish I had Colossi right now, because Colossi are a little bit more efficient. Ooh! Big explosions! Okay... Yeah, Colossi would be a little bit more efficient right now. Uh, but that's okay. Flying Spy. Yes, please. I would like a Flying Spy. Uh huh. Okay, guys, can you like get to the root of the problem here, please? AKA the cannon. Thank you very much. And then just level up weapons one more time because I really don't. Oh my god, he's got doubled up hybrid. That is scary. Double up hybrid? Say hello to my Reavers. Actually, yeah, this could be problematic. Big hybrid is gonna get eaten here. Uh, we are safe. From being detected. Uh, and I just gotta keep spamming Reavers, and I think we'll win here. Reavers will prevail. Reavers will prevail. I just need lots of them. Then Vipers will cause us some trouble here. We need probably need some like uh, Creeper Host, to be fair. Creeper Host would be really good. Uh, and speak of the devil, there they are. This guy went straight for the Creeper Host. Creeper host Reaver. Perfect combination. Tychus just has to hold the line now at this point. He just needs to get like a blaze. Or something. Ooh, why did I scan? So that you guys can see. Even though the Haka has a worm here. Oh, we're getting spat on. We're getting spat on here. Oh, he's getting some guardians. Oh no, not the guardians. Um. Damn. That's tough. There's so many of them. 
But yeah, these guys these guys beat him out pretty easily. Pretty handily here. I think Tychus can also 1v1 this Guardian. Come on, Tychus. Oh. Oh well. It is what it is. Okay, my Reavers are out of ammo. We got a Blaze coming out here. Big explosions. Alright. The Hawk is just going to eat that boy. Eat that boy. Going to level this up. Observers are observing. They're just chilling out here. There we go. Uh-oh. That's a lot of Guardians. I can't buy Tempest because Tempests are going to get completely slaughtered. They can buy Guardians. I really don't have an option except like Master Goon, which I don't want to do. Um, ooh. Mm -hmm. If I buy Phoenix, I think I'll still be in trouble because Devourers are pretty good against that. You can see these Reavers are just pelting, they're pelting, uh, I mean, not my Reavers, did it. The Guardians are pelting my Reavers here. But, um, despite being under fire for so long, Guardians are just impotent, man. They're, they're just impotent, boys. They simply do not have enough power. Plus, they also ignore the Reavers, so, like, congratulations, completely useless. And then the, um, Aerial Burst Sack is gonna take care of them here. Okay, I'm just gonna shield up here so we can be annoying for longer. Look at those homing missiles, baby. Homing missiles. Another one. Let's go, baby. Um, and look at all these abs about to get foddered off. Boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Actually, those Banelings do be crashing in. I do have a lot of uh, Guardian Shell. Um, oh, we are getting unstacked a little bit here. I could just get a bunch of Dragoons and, like, Guardian Shell those guys. Because um, they, can, they can hit back at the Guardians. But Dragoons are also vulnerable to Vipers, preventing them from attacking. I honestly think my only solution is to get Tempest. Um, but Tempest will get distracted by literally everything. So I, I don't know. Like Maybe I just go Phoenix. Uh, but Phoenix is like a diminishing return because like... Oh, I have an Observer here. No, no it's okay. It's so you guys can see better, you know? Um, yeah, you know what? I think we'll just have to call in some Tempest here. We'll have to call in some Tempest here. I, I don't really have a good solution for this. Besides going Tempest. Um, and to be fair, Creeper hosts are slowly killing off the Guardians. So I just gotta make sure all ground targets are eliminated. Okay. Let me see, let me see. I'm curious like how this next wave spawn does. Just wanna see what happens. Because we, we are getting pushed back. It is noticeable. We are in trouble. Um, I just want to make sure my Tempest lock on to the correct things. Tempests are not locking on to the correct things. Uh, but there are no more enemy ground units. So the Tempest can just go free for all and like blast these Guardians. Um, so there is that. Ah, uh, but as soon as... Okay, so I, I need to assemble Critical Mass of Tempest. Otherwise, they're just gonna, like, be distracted. Okay, so let's go. Yeah, the Tempest will get distracted easily. So I think it is bio... I mean, I'm Biomass. Lamel. Guardian Shell, these bad boys. And then let the Tempest cook. Oh, but the Tempest just go right after the units that can hit them! Yikes, the Tempest problem, the Tempest problem, Tempest Fugit, that is the Tempest problem. Uh -huh. But as soon as my, like, like, as long as we finish off every single ground unit, and we have, like, ah, no, Tempest, stop! Stop being dumb! 
Oh. Tempest AI, please. Vega is probably the best thing for us because it, it lets, lets my Reavers go into like obliteration mode against the Guardians. Um, okay. Plus, Reavers will just obliterate everything and anything here. So, as long as there's no ground targets, the Tempest should stop being dumb. And I, we just gotta kill off all the biomass ones. So, yeah, as soon as all the biomass ones are gone, the Tempest can just do whatever. I think my Tempests are actually a bit of a waste of money. Oh my god, doubled up Guardians. Doubled up Guardians, baby. Uh, let's shield up here. Doubled up Guardians. You know what, I'm just gonna go with Tempest. I'm gonna switch between Tempest and Reaver. Like Tempest, Reaver, Tempest, Reaver. Level up some Tempest weapons here. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, Tempest. They have two kills. They are literally useless. 54% of the team from Reavers. That's all the Reavers, though. Just pure Reaver power. They're Reaving. Um, okay. At least the Tempest kind of stay back and stuff. Like, like they just sort of chill. Ooh! And the Reavers just destroy the Banelings before they can make contact. It's so delicious. And the Guardians, even though there's so many of them, they can barely make a dent. Okay, there we go. They finally made a dent. Lamau. Yeah, I'm wondering if I should have just gone Phoenix. I wish I had, like, an air superiority unit. I wish the Haka had an air superiority unit, actually. The Tempests are just going after the base right now. They're like, uh -huh, forget about this. Actually, the Haka does have an air superiority, superiority unit, but yeah. We got a little stim coming out here because uh, they're little... They're like, uh-oh... Uh-oh, spaghetti -o. Spooky time. Spooky time. Send out some hybrid. Guess what? Hybrid don't do anything. Oh my god, the Haka with the... The Haka with the creeper host coming in here. I think Vega is honestly the best thing that's ever happened. This guy's but He's got, he's got Scourge. And the... Oh, but the Scourge actually getting... Tanking the Vega um, drop. That's actually bad, because they, they tank the Vega drop, and that's actually what I need to get rid of the Guardians in large numbers. Because um, if I caught Phoenix, they would just get obliterated by Scourge. So, like, that was bound to happen, you know? Um, that was bound to happen. And R.I.P. Tempest. Actually, the Tempest with their Guardian shell can just absorb all of the Scourge, and then just laugh it off. Kind of. Or like still, you know, take some more hits afterwards. So that's pretty good. Uh-huh. Gonna get soloed here, Lamau. Uh, let's put that in our Tempest here. Yeah, I wanna keep, I'm just gonna keep Guardian shelling the Tempest. I think that seems to be the right play. But, yeah. My Tempest definitely are not the ones that are doing the heavy lifting, though. So, there's that. Boom. Boom. Boom! Oh my god. The amount of devastation here. This is the devastation of Ball. Get him, boys. Boom! Boom! Yeah, but there's almost no time chance. Um, and all the Guardians just vanished. Vanished? That's a ton of Overseers. Too bad they don't do anything. R.I.P. There we go. Come on. Come on, boys. Just hit the base. Breathe on it, please. Reavers are out of ammo. They're, they're, out of, they're definitely out of ammo. That's why we didn't kill the base. Oh, I should have scanned. Oh my god. Breathe fire. 20 health. Nice. <laughs> nice. Oh, man. Reavers just feel so, so good. So juicy. So delicious. Tychus here. Yikes. What is Tychus doing? What is man's doing? Well, we, well, I mean, we got four gas. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. To be fair, his Vegas were helpful. Oh my god, he went upgraded weapons? Hmm, that's questionable. But yeah, I think he, he could have just kept spamming Vegas. And um, as long as the Vegas were there, grounding the Guardians, that's all I needed. 
Because as soon as they're on the ground, baby. Oh, baby. That's Reaver territory. Well, if you guys enjoyed this game, be sure to leave a like. And until next time, I will see you guys later. In the rear with the gear. F the tires. Let's light some fires. Need a light. They picked the wrong fight.